This is the ultrasound of a 40 years old young man with the history of uh, no, with no history of uh, trauma, fever, or any other uh, constitutional symptoms. He is a laborer. Now you see the wall thickness. The wall is thick. 8.8 .8 up to 8.8 .8, you see yeah this is the left hemisprotum and it is normal uh, sorry left hemisprotum showing normal testes i am going to show you the left and the right testes this is the right hemisprotum Now you see fluid with septals in this region. These are septals, these fine thread-like areas are all septals. These are septals, this is the fluid in the right hemisacrotum. Here you will see the testes and uh, in the testes you see the posterior area The testes shows normal vascularity. However, if we concentrate, we see that there is a lot of debris, thick debris with internal tiny uh, calcifications, punctic tiny calcifications. Here it's, you will see fluid in this region as well. This is fluid. This is the epididymis. This area. Epididymis is okay. However, the hemisacrotum, and this uh, there is a lot of fluid with septa, with debris, thick debris, with uh, den, um, multiple uh, tiny punctate calcifications within it. The sacrotal wall is also thick. This is also all fluid, baby course. Now this is, I wish to show you the uh, sacrotal wall. The sacrotal wall is more thick in this, uh, in the region of right hemisacrotum. This is the wall. And now the wall is thick up to in this uh, in the right Mbisacrotum up to 14.6 mm. This is the testis, this region. This is the testis. 
and there is all fluid within it. And you can see the degree of uh, septations. I'm sorry, there is some problem within my machine, that's why I'm uh, in problem. Now this is the testis. The testis by itself is now The testis is normal, however there is fluid with echoes, with septas, with debris uh, surrounding, uh, surrounding it. And this is our case of the day. Thank you very much.